if you ever wondered how the Tar Heel State got its name, it partially comes from the, the longleaf pine, which was harvested a long time ago when boats were made out of wood and they would use the, the sap from the, the longleaf pine, melt it down and make tar to seal the wood on the cracks between the wood so that the boats wouldn't leak. And that's how we, the Tar Heel State, got its name. One of the important things about this plant is that it is hard to transplant. For several years, this plant will grow in what's called the grass state. It usually takes three to five years where the, the plant doesn't get very long or very tall because it just stays in this really tiny, short, short vegetative growth phase. But in the spring of the year, these little things right here are called candles. This is the only growth that this tree will put on during the course of the year. And so it may grow three or four inches, or in this case, about 12 to 15 inches. And this nice white area right here looks nice and glossy and waxy, kind of like a candle. And so they call it a candle. It's native on these sandy areas in the, the Croatan forest. As you can see behind me back here, some of these trees can get 50, 60, 70 feet tall, and uh, they can live a, a long, long time. A couple of fun facts about the longleaf pine that you might find interesting is that the longleaf pine has one of the largest cones of any pine tree, um, where the cones can reach anywhere from 12 to 15 inches in length. This one here is about eight inches, so it's a pretty good sized cone. I like to use those in Christmas tree decor decorations, or during the summertime, just paint them with some peanut butter and put some uh, bird seed on there and hang them out for the birds and the squirrels. The other thing that I find interesting is that the longleaf pine, this area in the Croatan, is managed by wildfires or controlled burns. And what they do is they burn the undergrowth to make way for, for new pine trees to, to come up because the seed of the pine, this longleaf pine, needs to have the fire before it can germinate. Plus, they need the undergrowth to be uh, leveled out every once in a while to, keep, to make way for the red cockaded woodpecker who also make their cavities in the longleaf pine. These cavities make the uh, little saps come down out of the, the tree and um, help to warn some of the snakes away so the snakes don't crawl up the tree and get the eggs out of the nests. For more information about this and many other plants, visit our plant database or the North Carolina Cooperative Extension Office in your county.